Andy Warhol is a famous artist. He's famous because he's a pop artist. Now, pop means popular, and popular means rich for Andy. He's the artist who made Campbell's tomato soup cans popular and famous as art objects. He also created a series of 10 portraits of famous Jews of the 20th century. But more about that later. Meanwhile, his appearance this morning on Miami Beach to tour the Art Deco District turned into a media event with cameras, reporters, groupies, kids, and curious onlookers all crowding around Warhol, who looks like a white-haired cherub out of a 19th century Dickens novel. I talked to the famous artist about his art before the luncheon at the famous restaurant. Your work tends to be, uh, uh, I don't want to use the word sensational because that connotes something bad, but you want attention. Uh, oh, no, that's not true. I, I, uh, I work most of the time, and then um, I just have, well, they make me do this, so. Well, this, okay. this oh, must yeah. feed no, I, your, your arsenal. Uh, no, it doesn't. No, I, we're, 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 uh, we have a business going in New York. We do in you know, our magazine interview, and we have a cable TV station, and uh, it's sort of a nice way to start young kids. And just Why did you uh, decide to allow Miami to have the premiere of your exhibit? Uh, well, I, I guess I always wanted to uh, see it this way. I mean, gee, it was really wonderful. I guess I would never, if it, if, if it didn't happen, I wouldn't uh, see if it saw the... Are uh, your portfolios selling? Uh, well, I, I haven't seen them in so long, so <laughs> they, they might be. What uh, has your art to say to uh, the 20th century? That's a ponderous question, but I'm curious. Uh, well, I, I don't really have that much to say about them, but what I try to do is just to have uh, people remember the things that I draw about, you know, the subjects. You want them to recognize objects that they use rather than objects that they worship or adore. Uh, well, no, no, objects that they worship and adore. Are common everyday objects. Are common everyday objects, yes. Well, we're a self-destruct civilization, in other words. Uh, no, I don't think that makes things self-destruct. I, I, I think it makes it just uh, much better. Do you want them, those who buy your work, to keep it and study it and live with it. Uh, and then sell it. And resell it. Yes. Why? Well, uh, well, it's like everything else. I think everything else should be recycled, like uh, leftover um, food at restaurants. Well, that's your concept. That's the Andy Warhol touch that makes it different. Uh, well, that's what I sort of believe in. That's Andy Warhol, the artist. I'll review his show at the U of M Low Art Museum Monday night. I'm Sam Hirsch, your critic at large.